Okay, uh, today what we're going to do with our micro bit, we're going to make a night light. So what we're going to do, we're going to just compare the light level. So it's going to be relatively easy. We're going to start off with a forever because I want my night light to run forever to determine if it is daytime or nighttime for my light to go on or off. Next, I'm going to need a logic. Um, I'm going to need a logic block here. So I'm going to use the if else block here. Now, uh, determining my light here. So what I'm going to need to do, I'm going to need a comparison. So I'm going to need to go back to my logic, and I'm going to go into my comparison, and I'm going to drag that up here to where it says true. Okay, so now it says if 0 equals 0 then. Okay, so what am I trying to compare? I'm going to try to compare the light level. So my light level can be found in my input drawer, because remember, it, uh, light's going to be an input. So I just have to locate light level. And here's my light level. So that's going to be my first comparison. So if the light level, okay, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to say if the light level is less than, so right now it's currently on equal to, but I'm going to change it to less than. So if the light level is less than, and I'm going to put 20, this should work for us. So I'm going to say if the light level is less than 20, what do I want it to do? Well, I want the lights to go on. So what I'm going to do with this, I'm going to use a digital write pin. So we're going to need to scroll down here to my pins drawer. And I'm going to use a digital write pin. So remember, these are our digital write pins down here. So I'm going to say digital write pin. And I'm going to say digital write pin. And why don't we use pin 1? So we'll use pin 1 here in case we wanted to add something else. But we'll use pin 1. And so if digital write pin is set to 1. So here we go. Let's take a look at it. It says, if the light level is less than 20, then digital write pin 1 will be set to 1. Remember, setting it to 1 here tells it that it is on. Okay. So if the light level is less than 20, then what we need to do, we need to get another pin here. And again, I'm going to use a digital write pin here again. And there we go. So I'm going to say a digital write pin uh, one is set to zero and there you go so what that'll do here it'll indicate uh, if it is on or off so right now the light level is set at 128 so being that it is 128 it is greater than my 20 so that means that the pin zero is off as you guys could see right here and if this was set to let's say 20 um, then the obviously pin would go back on or the pin would go on and it would uh, shine a light. So hopefully this makes sense here for you guys. Uh, again, nothing too crazy. If you want to add some additional features here, obviously you can. Uh, but this is just the basics here for uh, to get a light on and off uh, determined by the light level of 20. All right, hope this helps.